whatever you seek for a reward, you will surely get. Jesus tells us in Matthew chapter 6, verses 1 through 4, that our motivation for doing something and the reward that we seek for doing that something is what we'll get. To illustrate this point, I'd like to tell you a quick story about a pastor of years ago, Charles Spurgeon. He would sell chicken eggs. He lived in London. He passed through a very large church, probably one of the first mega churches of, to ever exist. And church members, some of them didn't like it. They were like, we pay him well enough. Why is he selling the chicken eggs? Some people wanted discounts for the chicken eggs. And he would never give a discount. He would never stop selling the eggs. And then when he died, some four or five missionary families came and thanked the church for their generous support through the years. To find out the church hadn't actually been supporting them, all the money that went to their mission came from Charles Spurgeon. See, Spurgeon had been investing in a heavenly reward. And the question today is, what are you investing in? Are you investing in rewards here, right? Praying out loud and doing righteous things here? Or are you investing in things in heaven? Jesus said, don't let the right hand know what the left is doing. Spurgeon did that. What about you?